Okay, so it's 2024 and you guys, some of you guys still might be wondering like how to turn on the FPS render of, uh, you know, the CPU and GPU monitoring feature that comes with this MSI Afterburner. So basically I was having some problem. I never used it before. I never have overclocked my GPU and, or CPU. And I'm running this GX 970. So, what I, I was having some uh, problem with my PC. It was turning off. So I was thinking what to do, how to monitor the temperature. I tried different stuff. So I was searching on the website uh, Google. That is, I don't know why I said that. I was searching on the net, and I just came up. Uh, it came across. Uh, this MSI afterburner and it also comes up with this this thing rebut winner we call come to it Most of you already know about it. So basically what you do here is after you install it You you know the MSI afterburner you can uh, it is like this Software is already in there Like you installing it tells you to install it. You need to install this so once you're here go to the settings uh, monitoring you can see I have this checked ups there are a lot of check things like many things as if for example most of you will all not most of you every CPU that comes today has a lot of cores um, mine has six cores and it's uh, i5 8600k uh, yeah I'm bit back but uh, it gets the job done so I'm continuing with it so basically what you have to do is you have to check the temperature of GPU the usage the memory usage the core clock the power used by your GPU then there is the CPU and same thing so basically there are check marks that are unchecked here so instead of getting all the CPUs like CPU temperature or usage like there are six CPUs so each having separate temperature and usage if you get this CPU temperature with and use it without any number it will give you the average temperature going on with your CPU so all you have to do is there, there won't be shown like in OST on screen display here all you have to do is click on it for example if I need this I don't know what is FB usage is but to sh get it on the screen I will have to do this show in on screen display OSD it will be here so yeah that's uh, that's the first thing you have to do it and you can also set us to you know a key hotkey to check it uh, to toggle it on and off and after you're done here you just need to come to this guy right here you know here it won't show like the afterburn once afterburn is down you can open it from here same goes with this reward tuner so once you're here you go you need to go to setup and like me i did all these things but i was starting games like yeah, i was playing ghost of tsushima and it wasn't showing there right so the missing thing was this you have to go to plugins and it was here like uh, this overlay editor it was unchecked like uh, like this right so I could see like it was running in the background but it wasn't showing so I've seen I've searched it uh, on online like search it online for me about it and it wasn't like clearly shown uh, on in one one thread i got it in one thread the guy said you have to just make sure that it's checked and it worked so for example it's here right it's not checked and i have a z button so i'll just turn on a game you know, let's go with this ball of war uh, and it's not showing well or not here at least I'm also pressing the hotkey uh, while it's showing right it wasn't showing at that time so basically it was like this uh, now it's showing after the hotkey so that was the thing what I had to do was like check this here uh, some some you know and then I just uh, just went with ok and it worked so basically this 
right here is the answer. You just need to get it checked. That's it, and it'll work. Uh, hope you guys uh, well, like the video. Like you can see, it's right here. And usually, I make like the walkthroughs of different games or broadcast online. I uh, don't do the software thing, so it was I struggled with it. So I thought maybe I make video. Uh, most of you who don't know about it might uh, you know benefit from it. So thank you for watching the video. Take care. Uh, bye.